fucking trick. What? You bailed on me. I didn't bail on you. You said you were gonna do something and you left instead of doing it. That's the definition of bailing. Okay, but if you said we should burn our dicks off and I didn't, that's not bailing. It is bailing if you promise to burn your dick off in the first place. Look, the thing is, you're a bailer. You bailed on me this morning when Terry spat on me and you're bailing on me next year. There it is. There, it finally comes out. We were supposed to go to college together, Evan. It's elementary school. Whatever happened to that? What happened to that is that you're too stupid to get into the schools that I got into. Why you touch my man titties, man? You know they're sensitive. I'm sorry. How I many fucking times do I tell you that they're sensitive? I'm sorry. I was not too stupid. I was too lazy. You know what? That's like our problem, man. Like you're just... Your laziness like rubbed off of me, man. I just spent the last three years just sitting around talking bullshit with you. You know, wasn't able to talk to any girls. You know, could have got more friends, but you know, I just spent my last three years sitting on the couch just talking bullshit with you. You know? Fuck you, man. I mean, now because of you, I'm gonna go to college a fucking friendless virgin. Fuck you, Seth. Fuck you, Evan. Oh, Don't touch my oh, titties! Shit. Get the fuck off me, man! There's a fork going on. Shit! Oh, shit! Yeah. Shit! You know, I don't even know anymore, Ray. I just don't know. See, I was raised believing certain things. I was raised Catholic, see, and... I've more or less rejected all of it. Yeah, the nuts, aren't they? It's more than that. They... See, I grew up... I, I, I want to be a good person. If I see an old lady walking down the street, and she's carrying her shopping... Well, I don't offer to help her with her bag, see. I. I don't go that far, but I will hold open the door for her and I will let her go first. Yeah, but if you're trying to carry her shopping, she most likely will just th try to think you're steal her shopping. Exactly. This is the world we live in today. And now I have to reconcile with the fact that yes, I have killed people. Not a lot of people. And most of them were not good people. Well, except for one. Who was that? His fellow Danny Oliband's brother. He was just trying to protect his brother, see, and... He was a lollipop man. He came with a bottle. What are you gonna do? I shot him down. Okay, well, I mean, a bottle? That's a deadly weapon. You know, he's gotta understand the consequences. I know that. But he was just trying to protect his brother. Yeah, but a bottle, that can kill you. You know, that's a case of it's you or him. You know, if he came out with you with his bare hands, that'd be different. That'd be unfair. Well, technically your bare hands can be a deadly weapon. See, say he knew karate or something like that. You said it was a lollipop man. He was a lollipop man. What's a lollipop man doing known fucking karate? I don't know, I was just saying. How old was he? About 50. What's a 50 year old lollipop man doing known fucking karate? Was he a Chinese lollipop man? No, of course not. Jesus, Ken, I'm trying to talk about. I know what you're trying to talk about. 